welcome to Letterland Story Corner. Today's story is... Sammy Snake Isn't Satisfied by Lisa Holt This is Sammy Snake. He loves the seaside. Sometimes he swims in the sea, but most of all he likes to sunbathe on the sand. He always takes care of his skin in the sun and slaps on lots of sun cream. Sometimes Sammy wears a sun hat and sunglasses too. Sammy Snake hisses his sound like this. Can you hear him hissing at the start of words like sun, sea and sand? I'm not satisfied, hissed Sammy to himself. I'm not satisfied with being the same as everyone else. I'd like a special skill. I'd like to be a superhero, the strongest snake ever. Ooh, and I'd have superpowers. A super sense of smell. I'd sniff out danger like smoke and save the day. Sammy smiled and then scowled. Stop! No, no, he hissed. If I was a superhero, I couldn't be a superstar. I'd like to be a superstar. I'd sing on the stage. The sound of my singing voice would be splendid. Stop! No, no, he hissed. I'm still not satisfied with that. On second thoughts, he said, I suspect I could be a sports star, a soccer star, a skydiver, a sailor, a skier sliding down the slopes, a swimmer speeding through the sea. No, 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 stop. I'm still not satisfied, he said. Secretly, I've always thought I'd be rather a splendid space scientist. I'd soar between the stars and satellites in my spacecraft. I'd explore the solar system. Sammy Snake sucked on some strawberries and sighed. Suddenly, he felt rather sleepy and sat down, thinking. What I'd like best of all right now is a snooze in the sun. The sand was soft and warm. He could hear the sound of the sea and smell the scent of the seaside. Sammy smiled. In fact, Sammy smiled so much that he started to hiss and laugh. He hissed and snorted and slapped his sides with his tail. The sound of Sammy hissing was so loud that some of his friends came to see what the fuss was about. Talking Tess gave him a tap. Peter Puppy gave him a pat. Are you all right? asked Annie Apple. Sammy opened one eye sleepily. I have realised that my life is super, just as it is. I have somewhere safe and soft to sleep. The sun is shining. I have splendid things to eat. 
I have super friends like you. Simple and oh so satisfying, he said, smiling. Then he closed his eye and went back to sleep. This time he didn't hiss. He snored softly instead, as he often does at the ends of words and stories. Zzz.